Right, welcome back. Um, just want to do a shout out to Gundawindi State High School, Mr. Wilson, and his year 11 and 12 students for using these lessons to uh, improve or up upskill themselves in GIS. So, shout out and keep going with the great work you're doing out there. Right. We're going to do aged care this time. So we're going to have a look at uh, over 65 age groups in Bribey Island. Uh, I've already done that map. So statistical area one, age population over 65. Now we've done the predominant category. So we can see here that uh, 65 to 74 is the dominant category. But we've got a few uh, patches here uh, of uh, 75 to 84. And what I've found is the aged care facilities. Now, this is a way we can create a really sophisticated map. So we've got our layers of population density of older demographics, but what we're gonna do now is this aged care data um, is care type, and we're gonna do residential places because that's gonna help us generate a really interesting and really good map. So I'm just gonna change it. Look, we've got home care, residential, multi-purpose, short-term restorative care. So a number of different care facilities. I don't like the circle. I'm gonna change that to a diamond. Um, so I'm just gonna go into symbols, diamond, done. I'm gonna change the background outline to black so we can see really clearly. I quite like the colors there. Uh, it, pops so we're just going to go done done and we've got our layers um, set out here is our legend quite complex i don't think it'd fit on a static map so you might want to do things uh separately if you're doing a static map but what a great way we're going to go in and save save and open and away we go. Now, next lesson, we're gonna use this, uh, it's gonna be 6A, and we're going to look at creating a mapping application. Thanks for listening, talk to you next time.